Hi guys, uh, this is the tutorial for Billie Jean by Michael Jackson. And the first thing we need to talk about is a new technique called a bar, which you haven't done, if you haven't done before, is where you get one finger and you put it on more than one string on your ukulele. Okay, so the first thing we're actually gonna do with your thumb, and this is what you're gonna do all the time in the verse, you are just gonna play the bottom two strings on your ukulele like that. Okay? And that's all you're going to do in the verse. Only play those bottom two strings. Otherwise, you're going to get a funny sound. Okay, so that's the first thing you do. Just play those bottom two strings. After that, we're going to do this bar. Now, to do a bar, imagine that your finger and your thumb are like a crocodile's mouth. And you're going to clamp your crocodile mouth onto the bottom two strings, like that, on the second fret of the ukulele. Now, what you've got to make sure is your thumb, if you have a look at my thumb, it's halfway down, oh, just move that angle a little bit. It's halfway down the back of the ukulele like that. It's not above, it's not pointing that way. It is, God, this is really difficult. It is not pointing down either, it's upright. Let's try it like that, that's better. It's upright, okay? So make sure your thumb is upright. Try and keep that crocodile mouth shape and think clamp, okay? So we're on that second fret and you're gonna strum again those bottom two strings. Okay, so so far you've got the open strings. Second fret with your first finger, and then after that, change to your second finger, put that in the third fret, but do exactly the same thing. So you're doing a bar, still keep that crocodile mouth on the third fret and play that. And then after that, you're going to go back to the second fret with your first finger. So it's open strings, second fret, third fret, second fret. You're going to play that. Okay, and after you've played that twice, you're just going to do the same rhythm, but on the open strings. Just play the open strings twice around. And then go back to the open, second fret, third fret, second fret. Okay, so that whole thing. Open, second, third, second, open, second, third, second, and then open. Okay, and that's the whole verse, that whole sequence there, and you do that twice round. So the whole thing twice round, and then you get to the bridge, which is the bit in between the verse and the chorus. And to do the bridge, you're gonna start on a D minor chord. Now, if you can't remember how to do a D minor, start with your first finger, first fret, second string, then your second finger on the second fret on the fourth string, if you've got that by itself, that is an F chord, so that's an F chord. And then once you've got your F chord, add your third finger to the second fret on the third string. Second fret, third string. Can everyone see that? I hope that's so. So let's go over there again. First finger, well, let's start with the second finger because that by itself, second finger, second fret, fourth string, that is an A minor. Add your first finger to the first fret, second string, so make an F, and then Third finger, right underneath your second finger, second fret, fourth string, like that. And that's your D minor chord. All right, so you're gonna go from a D minor, four beats on that one, and then to an A minor. Back to D minor, A minor, do that three times. And then after you've done that three times, you're gonna go to an F chord, and you're gonna play that three times. Yeah. And then we're going to go to an E7 chord, and you can play that five times. Now, an E7 chord is a G7 chord, which is your triangle chord, remember that? But with your first finger up to that fourth string. So let's go over each chord, each finger. So you start with a G7, start with your first finger, first fret, second string. Second finger, second fret, third string. Third finger, second fret, first string. So you've got that triangle shape. And then to turn it to an E7, Move your first finger up two strings. So it's now on the fourth string. And that's your E7 chord. And you're gonna play that five times, that's it. Okay, so that's the bridge. So you've got D minor to A minor. Do that three times. And then F, E7. 
and now that F to E7 is quite difficult, so that's something that you probably want to practice. F, 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 E7, E7. Okay, and once you've done that, you just go back to the verse again, which is the chorus this time, okay? So it's the same thing for the verse and the chorus, but this part of the song is the chorus. So let's try playing that all the way through with the track. If I can find it, here we go. Okay, so we start to open to now. Open. Back to open two. Then do the same thing again. Open, second fret, third fret, second fret. Then open, open. Open two. Okay, now the D minor. Then A minor. D minor to the A minor. One more time, D minor. A minor, then the three F to E7. F, F, F. E7, E7. Back to the beginning. For the chorus this time. Sequence over and over again. 